Your phone is a lot bigger than you think. Whether you have a 16, 32, or 64 gigabyte phone, you've got even more space than you can use out there in the cloud. I'm Graham for Wireless Wave TV, and today we're tackling cloud services. Now there are three big names in cloud storage. Microsoft SkyDrive, Dropbox, and Google Drive. All three are accessible on all four major platforms, with apps available on iOS, Android, and Windows Phone for each service. So let's start by taking a look at SkyDrive. Now this one's attached to your Microsoft account, so if you don't have one, you'll need to make one. No worries though, it's free. SkyDrive has the advantage in the free space department. It comes with seven gigabytes of space right off the bat. You can upgrade that to 50 gigabytes for $25 a year. You can access your files on mobile through SkyDrive app or through your browser. It tracks versions and ties into Microsoft Office, which is pretty slick. So that's SkyDrive. Dropbox, on the other hand, has a big following with power users. Now you don't get as much free storage from the start, it's only two gigabytes, but you can earn even more space by inviting friends and family to join. Bumping up to the next tier is pricey though, it's $100 for 100 gigabytes per year. Now Dropbox does offer some smart features like media streaming for various file formats right in the app, and you can share files and folders relatively easily. Finally, we've got Google Drive. Drive ties into Google Docs, so if you've used Docs to edit or create stuff in the past, you've got a Drive account. It comes with 10 gigabytes of storage built in now, shared with your Gmail account, but you can bump it up to 100 gigs on a monthly basis for $5. Google Drive is a great choice if you're tied into the Google ecosystem daily. It gives you access to all those documents on the go. You can edit stuff collaboratively with friends or coworkers, so working on a document or spreadsheet with five or six other people isn't unusual. It isn't as powerful as Microsoft Office, but you may find that it gets the job done. So with all of those things in mind, you might be thinking, well, which one should I use? It's a tough call. The synergy between Windows Phone and SkyDrive isn't unexpected, and the same goes for Google Drive and Android. Dropbox seems to be the most platform-friendly for everyone, and the ability to play media right in the app can be an important feature. Right now, the most mature of the bunch is Dropbox, but you should give all three a chance to see what works best for you. Do you have a favorite cloud storage platform? Let us know in the comments below. I'm Graham for Wireless Wave TV. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We'll see you next time.